There were very good reasons why Bulgaria should have joined when indeed she did. Um, but if you remember in 2007, uh, there were problems and question marks about dealing with organized crime and corruption and reform of the judiciary and matters of that nature. And we were very optimistic and hopeful that once Bulgaria was, if you like, inside the club, uh, that they would take uh, strong steps uh, to overcome those difficulties. Now, one of the great disappointments has been um, inadequate attention to those problems. And I'm not sure we have fully learned the lessons from that recent enlargement, because uh, although the question of Croatia seems to be done and dusted, the fact is the same concerns are expressed today about Croatia. Mm -hmm. And there is rampant corruption. You do have a politically appointed judiciary. And there are any number of other problems, and there's organized crime, um, which the Croatians haven't yet dealt with. And so mm -hmm. we haven't properly learned the lessons. And the, the, the point is that the enlargement process is essentially a political process. It, we go through all this elaborate procedure of objective criteria and everything, but actually at the end of the day, it is a subjective political judgment whether or not the European Union enlarges.